opportunity to go to the man that's like call you out. Any questions over here? Any questions over here? Fight fair, fight hard. Touch him up. Okay, and so both off. guys touch gloves. Robino comes out right away with a leg kick, returned by Josh. Now again, uh, the Hensel Gracie's Academy um, main instructor, Joe St. Pierre, everything is clean. They want crispy, clean technique. Everything you'll is thrown with a purpose. Everything is very clean. That, that's that's how they like to work. You'll also notice that they have a disregard for orthodox or southpaw. They'll throw off both sides comfortably, mm -hmm. um, which I think is a lot more progressive than breaking it down to orthodox or southpaw. Right. Um, it's just a difference in angles. Uh, you'll see that with Elijah Clark. You'll see that with Joe Samperi. You'll see that with all Ann Lieberman. They all tend to switch, switch uh, basins. Well, I think that, you know, having a, even sometimes your stronger position in front is important. You know, mm -hmm. it was a Bruce Lee principle. Ooh. It's a slip. It's a slip. Oh, nice body Very kick landed nice. by Josh there. And answered back quick. Now, again, it, Looking this to bring that left elbow into the game here. Yeah, this is full tie rule, so the elbows are included. You can see Lovino trying to land some of those over the top in the clinch earlier. Josh being successful with the, the body kick and the speed of his kicks. Nice teep there as well. There's that body kick again by Josh. Mm -hmm. Nice combinations, uh, you know, by Guzman, but he wasn't really landing flush towards the end of that first round. So good, good feeling each other out process here in the first round. All right, so we're starting round two. Guzman coming out with a leg kick right away, blocked by Josh. Nice answering back trading, by both fighters. Trading back yeah. and forth with the low kicks. And Guzman's timing is just really, really precise. Yeah, Josh's body kick has been working for him very well, too. Nice leg kick there by Guzman. What Josh is doing is he's standing in the southpaw stance. He's uh, taking away a little bit of the range and the power from yep. uh, the right hand of Guzman. Makes the positioning a little bit awkward, too, especially if you can stay to the outside of the lead leg. Yeah, you're also vulnerable uh, to, to hooks and uh, straight left hands. Right now, Josh is moving towards Guzman's right. Oh, Big nice Big E lands by Guzman. Answer the front tip. Oh. Yeah, he, he Josh really has a, a great um, left kick. Oh, good teeth to yep, the face. Guzman smiles it off. He's a gamer. Yeah, they're just ex exchange, exchanging here. Really good exchanges. The teeth parried by Josh. And you were saying Guzman took this fight just I like, think like two weeks, like with two weeks notice or maybe even a week's notice, I'm not sure. Well, but I believe Josh was scheduled to fight someone else. Uh, nice a shot over the top, good jab by Guzman. Yeah. Oh, and that ends round yeah, two. Good. Touch gloves to come into round three. Okay, checked. Both fighters very, yeah. very active. Neither one of them seem to be slowing down super here in the crisp, third round. Super sharp. And Guzman is just rapid firing that left, that left 
burn kick, that front leg. Now, if you're you just, can see jo Josh is a little bit red on the inside of that thigh and outside too. Yeah, they've been exchanging <coughs> kicks. Oh, uh, elbow lands there by nice Josh. Knee. Now what Josh is doing is he's tying up uh, the arm of Guzman so that he's not able to land any knees flush. He's keeping him close. Controlling uh, the elbows behind the elbows and at the top of the Ooh. elbows is really, really important for the clinch. Oh, oh, awesome. Beautiful Guzman sweep. goes for a cross block, and Josh is able to come right underneath for a beautiful sweep. Wagner readjusting the elbow pad. Yeah, they're so annoying. Nice over the top right hand lands by Josh. Goes for a kick up high. Good parry teed by Josh. <coughs> He's not starting to hold his hands a little bit lower than he was previous. And Josh is not blocking that uh, that that right kick or that left kick as much anymore. He can take, oh, yep. Yeah, he's, he's, taken that, he's taken that several times. Nice jumping elbow that ends our round three. three. A lot of damage. Now they might be throwing the same amount of kicks, but if I'm going to look at Josh's legs, it's going to, you know, it it looks like he's eating a lot more damage than, than Guzman has. <coughs> Scoring wise, I believe that body kicks actually uh, will score a lot higher, higher than, than the leg, leg kicks. kicks. Yeah. Ooh, nice that was fight. a big overhand right uh, landed by Guzman. Another right hand lands by Guzman. That was ruled a that slip. Was a slip. Guzman's being very smart about this. He'll finish everything with a low kick. Yeah. He'll throw a hand combination, go upstairs, and then come back downstairs, and because he knows it's there. They're both good counter fighters. I, I mean, it, it, everything is about answering back for the two of them. Mm -hmm. You know, even if Josh does land something significant, uh, Guzman comes back so quickly that it's almost he tries to erase it in the mind of the judges. Yep. Josh is starting to check that kick now. There's a nice knee that lands by Guzman. Josh looking for the dominant position as they both swim out. You can see Josh has underneath the elbow and he's grabbing. Big uh, elbow kind of lands more towards the back of the head, so Chris Wagner gives, gives him a, a bit warning. of a warning. Oh, there, there was a nice uh, left hand that landed, a little Superman punch that landed by Josh, and he continues on with that. Guzman's got to start work, got to start working the jab. He's letting, uh, he's letting Josh get off too quick. He's letting him get, he's letting him get his timing, letting him get off. Yeah, I think he's listening to you. He's just trying to work that boxing in. He's, he's really landing a lot of these uh, leg kicks on Josh. You can yep. see both of Josh's legs Ten are very, call. very red. Josh still staying laser-like focused and moving forward, but Guzman just let off a 1-2-1 one, one, uh, to end that round. It's a tough fight. You know, you prepare for somebody, you get somebody else, and you get a very tough opponent, at, you know, yep. in almost the last minute. Oh, you know, good show of good respect show from respect. both guys. Good sportsmanship. Yeah, they're good counterfighters. They're bringing out the best in each other right now. Guzman nice putting some nice combinations Ooh. together. Josh, that, that beautiful body okay, kick. Josh is starting to feel. He's starting to feel that leg is starting to show. Yeah, you can tell because your legs get a little closer together. You're not able yep. to keep your uh, your stance as easy. Nice right hand lands there by Guzman. Guzman really trying to attack those legs. Josh going in for, for the, the elbow. Exchanging knees. Nobody really having the dominant position. Guzman was able to slip out and then land a hard jab there. Beautiful teep by Josh. Another teep by Josh. Oh, 
Oh, little bit of a little. Oh, oh, oh. Guzman attacking, yep. putting everything together. Josh ties him up here in the clinch. Beautiful use of the head in the clinch. Really good, and that's one of the things you'll see at Gracie's is they will use. Oh, nice. He's lighting oh. him up a little bit. A lot uppercuts landing, one two landing. Superman punch lands there by Josh. Oh. Well, Guzman has been Josh able to knows do... he's got to get on his horse now. Yeah. Guzman has been able to use his hands and then step to his left. Yep. To try to get out of the way of the southpaw positioning, which has been which has worked for him well, that's so it. far. What he has yep. taken a lot of is that is that body kick. Yep. You know, Guzman using his teeth as well. Trying to back Josh up, not letting Josh set anything up. Josh going in for the clinch. Wow, that ends our Beautiful. fourth round. Now Josh knows he's taking. He's, he's, he's All right, ladies and gentlemen, after five hard fall runs, we have a winner. Great fight. Judge A sees this 45-50. Judge B sees this 45-50. And Judge C sees this 47-48. Unanimous decision in favor of Rico Parkso, Udino, who's in. The combinations of uh, leg kicks and, uh, and boxing and uh, just continuous execution is probably what won it for Guzman this evening. Really good fight.